you know, fight. And uh, it's unfortunate for Tim that he lost. And right now, it, it feels, and I told you this before we went live, um, or recording it, but anyway, um, I said, this might be a good thing in the long run. Like, I think a lot of fight fans are going to see this and be like, okay, I could, I could get down with this guy. Like, mm -hmm. he's a fighter. He didn't quit. If you, if you paid a ticket, you got your money's worth because he didn't pull out. Of, he could have easily just said, hey, I can't see. Get me out of the fight. But he continued to fight. I think in the long run, I actually think there might be a silver lining to this. Well, try telling that to Tim Zoo at the moment, right. I suppose. But oh, look, yeah, look, everything happens. Well, I won't say it happens for a reason, but there's always something that can come out of it. And you know, as this show, um, this uh, event showed that Fondora was fighting on a, in a prelim in an interim world title fight, and all of a sudden he's fighting main event for two world titles. So who knows what can happen? Uh, looks like Errol Spence is looking for Fundora. I don't know where Crawford falls in this, into the scheme of things, but there is a, remember, there is a rematch clause in this. So I would, I would dare say we'll